44, we all know someone who obsesses about weight, how they look, what they eat. Yeah, they're great at body shaming themselves, refusing to eat at restaurants. Health reporter Haley Hernandez explains what we should do and say when friends obsess about their weight. Yeah, guys, so as a society, we've gotten great at laughing when someone speaks badly about themselves, but if they called you fat, it would be outrageous. If they say it about themselves, it's considered funny. The truth is, it could indicate underlying issues. Sitting in a restaurant around a pool, out shopping. It's normally unsolicited, but commonly heard. Oh my gosh, me too. I feel like I'm such a whale today. Psychologist Catherine Rossetti from the Eating Recovery Center in Houston says women joke about being fat or hating their bodies, but the reality is it's bullying and it's time we stop each other from doing it. Almost kind of joke back and say, don't talk about my friend like that, right? It kind of points out the harshness and the reality that you're kind of bullying yourself. She says it's important to stop because normalizing this self-deprecation teaches kids not to be satisfied with their appearances. Oh, mom thinks that she's fat. That's how I should talk about myself. I or they'll start thinking that that's how they're supposed to respond when they look in the mirror, they try on clothes. But the reason we do it can be masking a different issue. Dr. Rossitti says we're often seeking reassurance or validation that we don't look whatever way we're verbalizing we do. A way for women to kind of bond, right? And if we actually took that out of what we were talking about as you know, in a relationships. Imagine all the things that we could actually spend time talking about if we're not wasting it on things like our bodies. So some of the things that she recommends, we talked with loved ones about are um, eating well, exercising to be healthy, not using exercise as a punishment, and don't focus on size. The scale does not always reflect when you're in good health. And if you want to stop speaking negatively about yourself, but you don't feel like you can, that's obsessive. And Dr. Rossetti says it's not healthy and should you should consult a professional about it. If you're actively trying to stop for mm -hmm. your kid's sake or, you know, just for the sake of not yeah. Yeah. harming yourself and you can't, maybe time to talk to somebody. Absolutely, great advice. Important topic, so yes. We appreciate Thanks, it. Guys.